Bye, guys. Happy little day. Today. No. Today I'm going to try to make single ladies by Beyonce without being able to hear anything I'm doing the whole time. My computer's going to be on mute. But I'm going to try to make this song sound just like single ladies by Beyonce. It's going to sound just like it. And you're going to be so impressed at the end. Wow, it sounds just like single ladies by Beyonce. But she didn't hear anything she was doing the whole time. Her computer was on mute the whole time. She was just going off of the visuals and her pure intuition. Yeah. But I'll make it so that you guys can hear what I'm doing the whole time. And then at the end of it, we'll see how close I got. We'll come together and listen to the song in full. But before we get into it, Queef Jerky, my band, is going on tour this summer. Touring our new album along with our other classics. Yeah, it's gonna smell wild in there. So it would mean a lot to me if you bought some tickets. They're on sale now. In the description, in the pinned comment, we got a new song coming out this Friday. I'll play a little snippet. All right, let's get into it. This song is 193 BPM. It's just not. No, it's not. Up in the club, just broke up. Doing my Probably got to go with the most popular clap. Something about this clap pattern tells me it's going to be way too fast because they're working with 193 BPM. It literally happens like the whole time. Like the claps are there the whole time. I'm a little nervous about that. No, I think this goes here. Maybe there. Yeah, I think that's got to be right. So we need that weird synth. It's like an electronic sound. Maybe like it's like a robot. We need like a. Don't dream me to the things of the world. I'm not that kind of girl. You guys know what sound I'm talking about for like that little robot sound, like the. And then there's that other sound in the chorus. It's like, wow. That sound to me screams power surge. Something about that feels right. I got gloss on my hips, man, on my lips. Doing my own little thing. Oh my God, guys, like this one, it's not gonna be good. Like this one's gonna be like really bad, actually. This was probably gonna be like one of my worst ones. But honestly, I need to be humbled. Guys, when I made Seven Rings by Ariana Grande, it's literally sounds just like it. Like it's not even funny. It's actually like impressive, like how much it just sounds like it. Wrist, stop watching. My, my neck is flossy. Deposit my gloss deposit. So I'm in it's due time for me to be really brought back down to earth and realize nope. Nope, it's time. This I think is somewhere in the song from what I can understand by what it's telling me it is. I think this is just the other bass hit in the song. Have you guys actually listened to this song lately? Like the beat on it is crazy. It's just crazy. Like, it was such a wild move to put this song out with this beat on it. Like, I don't really know how else to describe it other than this beat is just wild and it feels like it's so ahead of its time in a way. I saw a TikTok recently of people being like, oh my god, I can't believe some of the instrumentals. Like, how do some of these biggest songs in the, in the world, like some of the classic songs from the early 2000s, have beats that are just, like, so goofy? But I wouldn't put this song in the goofy cate category. I think a lot of people put the beat of this song in the goofy category. I think it's more ahead of its time. That's what we want. Or this. Cougar one-shot camera. I think that's what I probably want. Sure, this one. I don't even know. Sure, does that work? Does that sound like a single lady? Does that scream single lady to you? You want to take that riser out on a nice seafood dinner date? I'd really like that. I'd really like to go on a seafood dinner date, yeah. You know, one thing about me is I'd love to go on a nice seafood dinner date to Red Lobster. Order the lobster. <laughs> Me and my date were sitting at the table waiting for our lobster, talking about what we like to do for fun and our values, our hobbies, and our differences. 
the lobster comes and we feed it to each other. We put the little bib on. Who doesn't want to go on a little first date and wear a little bib on it? It's gotta work, right? We're gonna have to make that work. Sure, random. No key, no BPM, I just don't care. It's just gotta be something random. All the single ladies, all, all the single, single ladies. ladies, all the single ladies, all the single ladies, all the single ladies, all the single ladies. You know what? I am gonna use the metronome. Because the least I can do to make this song listenable for you guys, because already it's not gonna be really listenable. Least I can do is try to be on beat so that we can at least enjoy the end of this video together. I don't know. Up in the club, just broke up, doing my own little thing. Decided to dip, now you wanna trip. You guys big horror movie watchers, like scary movie enjoyers? You guys like scary stuff? Cause you know something I realized recently about scary movies? Cause personally, I'm a huge scary movie enjoyer. But something I realized, cause I was starting to think about it and I was like, dude, like, every scary movie is literally just about like a bad guy. Like a bad guy scares people. Or girl. Like, every single one. I can count, like, five on my hand that aren't about a bad guy. Or girl. Or monster. You can be like, oh, there's a million monster movies. That's just a guy. Just a guy in a different shape. Oh, what about the evil tire? Evil tire. It's just a guy. Like, it's just a bad guy. I'm a fun him. He a fun me. Don't pay him any attention. Cried my tears for three good years. You can't be mad at me. Cause I feel like it. Uh, what about the movie that's about like the haunted pool? What about the pool that's haunted with the demons in it? The pool's the bad guy. The demons are the bad guy. The pool has the demons in it. The demons are the bad guy. It's just a movie about a bad, scary guy. Just a bunch of them. Oh, uh, what about The Thing? Are you being real? Like, guys, The Thing is the bad guy. Like, it's like the bad guy. I don't know. I've, I've never seen The Thing. If you like it, then you should put a ring on it. If you like it, then you should put a ring on it. Don't be mad at what you see that hay on it. If you like it, then you should put a ring on it. What? Uh oh. What? Uh oh. Oh. Uh, uh, what? Uh. I used to be so scared of singing in front of people. Really scared of it. Until one day I decided, you know what? I gotta get over this. So then at college I went and I tried out for every single a cappella group, every single one. There's like four. I tried out for everyone and then got rejected from every single one. Fine with that though, you know, it made sense. I wasn't gonna get into the acapella group. I've never sung in front of people before in my life. Obviously I'm not gonna get in the first time. Fast forward to next semester, try out again, every single group. Still don't get into all of them. Hey, that's fine. Why don't I try improv? Tried out for all the improv groups, done. None of those either. What if I try out again? Nope, nothing. No one let me into anything! Don't treat me to the things of the world. I'm not that kind of girl. Your love is what I prefer. What I deserve. He's a man that breaks me and it takes me and I love I made it. What about the movie where uh, Jim Carrey's in the mask? What? What about that one? It's uh. It's the mask that's the bad guy, but guys, like, there's a guy in the mask. Are you crazy? Think about it. Every movie, every single scary movie, you cannot name a single one where there's not a goddamn it bad guy. Besides Nope. I'll let Nope pass. Nope gets a pass because the guy, I wouldn't even say, is a thing. It's, like, not even, like, you can't, you can't say what it is. Like, you don't, you can't say what it is. It's not like a thing. You know what I mean? If you like it, then you should have put a ring on it. If you like it, then you should have put a ring on it. Don't be mad about you see that he on it. If you like it, then you should have put a ring on it. What? Oh, like it, then you should have put a ring on it. God, I'm so annoying, actually. What if I- There is, like, the slightest, slightest chance 
there's always a chance. Nothing's impossible. There is like the slightest bit of probability that this sounds exactly like the song. I feel like I've been focusing on oh, this is going to suck. This is going to suck. Yeah, maybe with that attitude, but I think we should just acknowledge that there is like the slightest chance that it might sound perfect. All the single ladies, 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 all the single
called Queef Jerky. It's kind of like Daft Punk. Both of them are really cool. Check them out. It would mean a lot to me if you did. Queef Jerky is going on tour this summer, and you are not going to want to miss it because the Queefers go crazy. So if you want to go crazy this summer, tickets are in the description, in the pinned comment. It's going to be so fun. So I appreciate all of you really a lot, and I think you're really nice. So I'll see you again next time. Okay. Bye.